guys and welcome to this now today as like I tell we're in a set of Corsa we're driving the F2004 at Monza um I don't really know why I'm really doing this car in this track combination I was gonna do it at the Nürburgring but decided not to so that might be a interesting video um I'm gonna do F1 cars at like a certain track I'm not gonna really too sure about which track I'm gonna do yet um hot lapping around there every Friday I'm gonna call it F1 Friday that's gonna be pretty cool um so yeah, I'm gonna get on with my outlap. It's 2004, driven by Michael Schumacher in the 2004 F1 season. I'm gonna be trying to match Rubens Barrichello's pole time, which is a 120.089. I don't think I'm gonna match it, but I do think I'm gonna come pretty close. I'm just gonna prove myself wrong, aren't I? Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get on with my outlap and then see how fast I can get. So here's the lap, hoping it's a decent one. I only got seven gears. I usually always go for the eighth gear, but. I don't know why. It's going to break around 120 meters. Just so we get a nice entry into turn one. It's a really tight corner. As you can tell by all the death that happens there um, in online races and against the AI. Uh, don't be a bit bad with gear shifts. It's quite hard to talk over this. Um, this corner will break about the same amount as turn one. Oh, nearly. Had a bit of a lock up there. Don't use ABS because, like, whoa, Had a bit of oversteer there. We're gonna shift to third for this corner. I think that might be a bit too low. Oh, got a bit too much on the curbs. I think it's third for this corner and fourth for the other one. But I don't know. If we was in a modern F1 car from 2011 onwards, we'd be using DRS down the straight. Um, but we're not because it's 2004. The car's 16 years old. Um, Quite a weird break into for Ascari, but when you get it right, it's quite satisfying to be fair. Don't go wide like Max Verstappen did in the 2020 Italian Grand Prix, or last year. It feels weird, that's 2021, but I'm not going to talk about that now. Um, it's quite a long run down to Parabolica. In modern F1 cars, you can easily get 200 miles in this, in this um, straight. Don't go wide at Parabolica to invalidate the lap, because I just don't want to invalidate it. That's the only reason why. And across the line, I'm not too sure what the time is, I can't really see, but I'll just put it on the screen. Um, so that's the end of this video, hope you enjoyed it, uh, I know it was a short one.